G'day, ladies and gentlemen. My name's Cannon Fodder. We're playing more Victoria 2 with King Brunswick. Hmm. I'm not amused. Need to... Alright, so... Krakow's not happening anytime soon. Bail in Abu Dhabi. Drop Afghanistan and Bavaria down to very low. Denmark's kind of a high interest because I'd like to have him. Still have a truce with Kokand. Harder. Let's drop Persia down. Uh, colonial incident. <sighs> Invasion through there and then deploy troops and so and so interesting. Uh, place in the sun cast his belly on the Netherlands. Relationship changes by minus 20. I do not believe this is really worth going to war over, truth be told. Do I go to war with <laughs> the Netherlands? I mean... <gasps> Uh, Have fun getting to them. Yeah, I know, right? 5% more in favor of jingoism. Let's do that. I do not think it's worth it. <laughs> Could have taken a chunk out of the East Indies. Yeah, but like you said, good luck getting over there. Right. Let's see. So I still got a truce with you. I guess I guess we just wait. to have a hundred influence. Alright, let's wait for a hundred influence. And play the game. So the influence builds. We're also making a crap load of cash right now. What? The Ottomans? are in China. Sod off, Ottoman. <laughs> it's like the one in the middle that the, um, the Americans are always fond of trying to pinch. That's pretty weird. Alright, I need to start planning my next technological thingy. Um, I think ideological thought. Maybe get another national focus up. Speaking of national focuses, time to ferry the Cleggy around a bit. Clergy are going to get a perm. 
Ha, funny. Um, let's see. Oh, Kakao's ticking up, which means I'm not currently banned. Let's get out of that. At least they're at 200 then, I guess. Uh-oh, what? An alliance from Brazil, of all people. Eh, why not? Hello, globe and a half away. You having fun in two Sicilies? What? You having fun in the two Sicilies? I just built a bunch of railroads there for them. That's right, because they're in your sphere. Actually, I just want, built a bunch of railroads kind of in general there. Mm. We're going to discredit the Ottoman menace in Persia. Yeah, I'll just let that build. Things are indeed happening. Just uh, exerting some influence over some of the Chinese miners casually. This one ad where I have his personality. Yeah, is irate. Okay. That's all right then. It's basically he's just swearing all the time, really. I thought you had Egypt in your sphere of influence. No. Uh, I just took land from you. Alright. The Ottoman wants the booty, too. Oh. <sighs> Time for some... Time to move the clergy around again. Just... Admin up. Got a lot of laborers.
All right. Let's see. What do we do in the next ten minutes aside from twiddle our thumbs? I guess we twiddle our thumbs. Go, Panchuria, go! Uh, can we... Yeah. Our embassy got banned in Qinghai. How are you going to pop up for that? That's annoying. Alrighty then, sure. Can I do things to you now? Yes, I can. Right. Well, my power base in North Africa is kind of fully solidified now. Yeah, barring that one bit on the other side. Yeah. Al Riff and all that, but you have to go to Spain. You have to go to war with Spain for that. Oh no! Ah, I think I know what happened the, uh, when I was um, trying to do stuff in uh, Bukhara. I was discovered. And maybe booted from the country? Mm, no, it doesn't do that. How much infamy do you have? I don't know. In, in the politics next to the red flag 41 what I keep getting discovered stop the cap is 25 you do realize every single great power has a war goal on you right now To set up a colony. Sticking down. Yes, and don't increase it anymore. So basically, don't go to war with Kokand. Well, you've already justified the claim, so that's fine. I, I haven't justified the claim. It's at 39%. <laughs> okay. I'm justifying, but I haven't justified. Yeah, but have you been detected already? Yeah. Then it doesn't matter. Um, I could try and humiliate the United Kingdom or I could just thank them for their time I think more prestige how you haven't gotten attacked I have no idea uh, I'm big 
<laughs> means nothing. All right. Sphere of influence for a Chinese substate done. Um, make a lot of money right now. How much money do you have in your bank? Two mil. Okay, Cannon. Lower your taxes and tariff to the point where you're losing money because that is bad. Down to, let's see. All right. At 7% tariffs, I bump between minus 40, minus 70, and plus 20. No. No. Drop to zero tariffs and drop your taxes to 50. You have 2 million. And a good amount to keep in is around 500k. Alright. Do I need to drop spending on anything? No. Spending is different. Why, when did I take all these loans? That's weird. Manchuria at the sphere. Done. Right. And Denmark. Increase opinion. Nope, I have rebels. What? How, what the hell? The Nationalists. Hell? Really. Netherlands, how the hell did you conquer land from the UK? Okay, alright. I have a call on a thing. Couple of uh, events. Yeah, yeah. So you see the white island next to the land you just annexed from Manchu. Yeah. Click on that. And then click the little guys with the plus. Send one. expedition. Yeah, expedition sent. I have another event. Also, I'm now you losing like 900 and whatever. That's fine. Just lose it till you get down to only like 500k and then put it back to where you're making money. Right, Lib Literary Association of Friends. I can either ignore the issue and gain consciousness and militancy, or I can send in the secret police. Send in the secret police. Right. So, Canon, if you hit I, that's the map mode that shows you where you can colonize. 
Is... If it's green, you can colonize. If it's... I am now the ruler like of the east. Tan... It's like tannish color, then you're colonizing. Yeah, all right. And you're going to do it at... I right, need mission to civilize and colonial negotiations to do certain things. Yeah, that's most of them. That one you're colonizing right now is one of the few special places you can do it early. As is the one just above Persia, apparently. Yeah. Because it's actually green. <sighs> I love it, the little influence bar when you've got 100% influence goes green. Nope. Yep. Time to move the clay gear around. I guess I can get two guys doing... That will get Kiev to do capitalists. Because I can now have three things. Ah, oh, rebel factions. Hunt rebels. This is ready for rebel hunting. Okay. So. How do you deal with rebels again? I forget. You kill them. How? Well, if they've risen up, you march your army over there and crush. Alright. <laughs> Revolt risk zero. Zero brigades ready to join an uprising. But they have... Oh, yeah, those rebels you kind of just have to deal with. Right. The movements, though, you can notice, like... Like, right now, I have suffrage movement, which is building, which means if I have the ability to pass a reform, I should need to pass a voting reform. Right. Hold on a hot minute. It's the end of the episode, so if you like what you saw, you know what to do. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.